Hey, what's happening guys? My name is Rishabh and in this video I'm going to share a very quick tip with you guys. Okay, a lot of people have been asking me, how in the world do you have your face along with your screen recording? How do you have it in that corner over there? I have it in a few of my videos and you know what? It's pretty simple. It's nothing. You just got to record your takes first. You just sit in front of the camera, you record your stuff. Secondly, you just uh, do all the screen recordings. Then you place your face recording, basically this recording on top of your screen recording and you crop off all these edges and you have all you've got is your face. Then you just push it down. It's just that simple. Okay, you're going to tell me that it sounds simple. I'm sure it's not, but no, it's just as simple as it sounds. Okay, but one thing, I do all my video takes first because I record with a DSLR camera. But if you want to do both of the, both of, what the hell, both of these things together, like you want to record a screen and uh, be in front of the camera at the same time, you can just use a webcam and record an iMovie or something along with your screen recording happening. So that is if you want to do that. So this is how you basically crop your face and put it in the corner. Just keep following. Okay, so I'm going to start with a program like FCP. You could use iMovie or whatever, like Adobe Premiere. And it just needs to have this crop feature and an option to resize the frame. That's it. So now we just have a portion of the clip that we recorded some time back and what we n need now is the screen recording to sit right under this so let's find a screen recording there we have a screen recording this is not a proper tutorial that I'm making here I'm just kind of uh, showing you how you could crop the frame and make your face fit inside the screen recording so let's trim the screen recording to that much so it doesn't extend and the next thing is not now basically you can't see the screen recording at all because it's sitting right under this stuff so we need to resize this we need to crop it so we can see the screen recording that is right under this so we are just going to select the resize tool first and we can then resize this clip i'm going to resize it about that much and oh crap <laughs> Now, let's just crop out all the edges. So I just selected the crop tool, which is the second tool from the left. And let's just hold these edges and, okay, you've got to select the clip first. I'm going to pull it in. I guess that is fine. Do the same from the right side, from the bottom. And I think I'll just chop. No, I, I feel that's fine, you know. So there we have my face right in middle of the screen recording. So I could just then push it to any corner. If you feel like it's a little too big, you could just resize it even more. You could pull it in till you feel, you know, it's appropriate for your screen recording. So I think that should be good enough. So that's it. It was just as simple as doing that. Now, when you're going to play it back, you can see that your screen recording, your face is right in one corner of the video as you're having all your steps and tutorials going on on the screen. So if you like this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and do not forget to subscribe to my channel by clicking on this button right here. And I will see you next time with another video. Bye-bye.